Welcome to Pure Aqua for the most advanced reverse osmosis, water treatment, and purification systems worldwide. We're at the world headquarters of Pure Aqua Inc. and production comes at the fabrication of multiple systems going to the Middle East. Now, these systems are used for multiple purpose application in which we have several trains with redundancy amongst each train. We're treating well water with an RO system which will be used for agriculture purposes. And on the side by side on the, in this application, we have nanofiltration systems which will be treating the city water and that water or the product water of those systems will be used for portable use. So on the feed side of the nano filtration or portable use system or train, we begin with a pre-chlorination skid. Now this skid is a constant chlorination will maintain a residual chlorine within the, the tank of about half a ppm to ensure of course the water is effectively chlorinated and disinfected. We have redundant uh, recirculation pumps along with redundant chemical dosing pumps or chemical injection pumps. Um, we'll be of course just dosing 12% um, chlorine and which is just sodium hypochlorite. And this is controlled by a Siemens PLC uh, where the residual chlorine will be constantly monitored. And based on that, we will adjust our dosing settings of the, of the chemical dosings. Now, in this process, of course, we have throttle valves, pressure gauges and a flow meter where we monitor the recirculation flow rate to ensure that we, we are recirculating the proper amount of water on, on a daily average within that, that the feed tank. So now continuing on the portable side of this project, um, we begin on the nanofiltration system where this has been completely skid mounted with both pre and post treatment. So on the feed side of the nanofiltration, after the disinfection skid, of course we're gonna have a brake tank or multiple brake tanks, and then we have um, all twin alternating feed and backwash pumps. These are Siren 5s and of course they're stainless steel 316 and manufactured by Grunfuss. We have typical isolation valves, check valves and pressure gauges for the isolation of these pumps and of course the program automatically alternates between these pumps and kicks both on during backwash. Now after the water gets pressurized to about 40 to 50 PSI, it gets passed through a carbon filter where organics, taste, and the residual chlorine, which is maintained within the storage tank, gets neutralized. And then from there, of course, we begin the feed into the nano filtration side of the process. So after the, the carbon filter, the water gets injected with some anti-scaling where the anti-scaling tank is shown here, it has a mixer a metering pump, and a low level switch. Um, now after the anti-scaling injection, we pass the water through a five micron cartridge filter, and we have typical instrumentation where we have a low pressure switch, pre and post filter gauges, a high pressure pump, high pressure switch gauges, and then from there we feed into 18 membranes, two stages. The first stage will have four vessels, and the second stage will have two vessels. Um, we're using ASME pressure vessels here as it is required in this application. And on the reject and product side, we have very typical instrumentation. Now we pass the water, the permeate water through a calcite filter to neutralize the pH and remineralize the water as this is used for potable or drinking water. Thank you for choosing Pure Aqua as your primary supplier.